Ever wondered how submarines stay underwater for months without surfacing? Hundreds of crew members, no sunlight, no grocery stores. So where do they get air, water, and food? The first submarine, the turtle, could only stay underwater for half an hour. It had no engine, no oxygen system. Emissions ended the moment the air ran out. For decades, navies around the world tried to solve this problem. But limited power and oxygen forced them to resurface again and again. Power changed everything. Nuclear submarines use enriched uranium to generate heat through fission, creating steam that drives turbines and propellers. With this, a sub can operate for decades with almost no refueling. But power isn't the only challenge. What about air and fresh water? Modern subs use electrolysis to split seawater into hydrogen and oxygen. Oxygen goes to the crew. Hydrogen is vented into the sea for water. They simply distill seawater, boil it into steam, condense it back into liquid, and voila. Drinkable water. So if energy, air, and water are no longer problems, what's the one thing that still limits how long a sub can stay hidden? Be